Let's take a look at Mina now. 11th of August, um, Maya. Mina, I'm so sorry for applying so late. So I thought about it and I'm in. You'll be my first ever client. August 12th, Maya. First thing, I'm signing you on for an awesome group boosting service. You're going to be a star. Mina replies. Oh my god, I'm so excited. Thank you so much for officially being my manager. I feel like the real deal now. I'll follow all of your advice. You're going to be like my sensei. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. See you next week. And then August 31st, uh, Mina, um, Maya? Like, it might be a tech issue, but a song I uploaded got removed. Maya, I removed it. Mina, what? Why? Maya. Until you get a hang of managing your brand, everything goes through me first, okay? Mina. This isn't fair. You don't, like, own me, okay? Maya. Mina, I did it for your own good. Mina, you're giving me so much anxiety right now. Stop trying to control me. I'm not your pupper. <laughs> Puppet. Maya, okay, just relax and you'll see I'm right soon. It's all going to pay off. Mina, no, I don't believe this. I hate you. You're horrible. I can't wait till I get a real manager and then I don't have to like follow your stupid instructions. It's not like you're doing so great yourself right now, too. Uh, Maya? I'm sorry. That was really mean. I shouldn't have said that. I just get, like, really emotional, because, like, I totally care about what you think. Please don't hate me. Min calls out Maya's overbearing behavior and expresses her hatred for Maya. Ninth of September, Mina. I got it, I got it, I got it! Did I say I got it? Thank you so much, Maya. Your advice really worked. The last time I auditioned, they kept telling me I got the talent but lacked the X Factor. Like, what does that even mean? <laughs> but who cares? I did what you said and they booked me on the spot. I'm scheduled for next month, so please come, okay? Maya, that's fantastic. Told you I was right about the branding. 26th of September, Mina. Um, Maya, can you try talking to Arya and Rex to get off my back and let me do my own thing? Like, just let me breathe? I feel like they're just so... so condescending all the time. It's like... It's like really tiring to deal with. I mean, I, I know they're older than me and stuff, but I'm not a kid, okay? Maya. <sighs> Mina, you really need to learn how to stand up for yourself. I can't fight all your battles for you. Mina. I know. Maya. And anyway, they mean well. We don't want you making the same mistakes we did. Better hearing it from us than others, right? Mina. I guess so. I gotta, like, be more assertive. I'll try. Maya. That's the spirit. Oh, by the way, your last post? I'm not crazy about that picture. I think you can change it to something a bit more... edgy? Like, look away from the camera and, and scowl or something. Mina. Um, okay. 10th of October, Maya says. Oh no, Mina, I'm so sorry. I completely blanked and forgot about tonight. Did the show go okay? <sighs> I've been dropping the ball on everything. I've just been so tired, you know. I feel like I've been seeing. Never mind. I'll make it up to you soon, okay? Mina, it's okay. You are here with me in spirit. 16th of October, Mina. Uh, Maya, so I tried something new on Chimera. Let me know if it's okay. 17th of October. Maya, everything okay? 
18th. Are you like doing a gray rock on me right now? Fine. I'm so sorry, you know, I didn't mean that. Hope you're like, all right. 19th. Hi, Maya. Um, are you ignoring me or something? D did, did I do something wrong to annoy you? I feel like I haven't seen you in so long. You're not leaving us, are you? It's just that you're the best at keeping the gang going. And I need you to be around. Together. Yeah, so Maya's relationship to Mina is very different from her relationship to the other two. The other two, they were very much like colleagues, kind of on the same level. But with Mina, Maya was basically their manager. And Mina was really young and, and looking up to Maya. All right, so that's all the chats. Something new in Ward. What do we got? Wait, what is new? Is it this? Oh, I can say something. This influencer life really is something. Oh, so you've been learning more about our victim. Feels wrong looking through someone's personal stuff. I admire your ethics, but if it's any consolation, she's already dead. Like I said, to understand the crime, we have to really know our victim, down to every last detail. Well, it looks like she had some stalkers. Stalker, huh? Maybe one got a bit too obsessive. Look, I know I'm pushing you here, but even seemingly insignificant scraps of information might tell us something about this case. Just keep looking. You'll see I'm right. Right. Mail, good. Phone, good. Uh, why does chat have exclamation mark? Is that because I need to talk with them? These three? Yeah. So ignore that for now. Uh, oh, hey, media. My laptop. It is connected to it. Um... Yeah, we've seen all that. We've seen all of these. Yes. I don't think there's any new photos. Much of music. Most of which is sinking. Sinking, except for multicolored lies. I'm going to assume that this is like a real song from a real band and not just an in-game thing and so it'll probably get me copyright problems so i'm not gonna play too much of it let's just see if there's like a ghostly message in it or something nope unless i just missed it my laptop uh Username and password, of course. Oh, I could try forget password. Need you to answer these security questions to verify it's really you. Ooh, let's do this last. I want to gather more information. We still have Surfer, Chimera, and Jabber. Okay, yeah, so Jabber is like Twitter. Oh my god, that's so obnoxious. Is that all the recent messages we've gotten, I guess? Or what? Dear God. Maya Crane. Yogi, vegan, all-around positivity magnet. Hmm. Their last post on uh, Jabber was almost a month ago. Well, this was two months ago, so they've only been on Jabber for a little bit. You guys need to listen to this. I swear, it's my favorite song of all time. Who needs a playlist when I can play Multicolored Lies on repeat? That's a song we just listened to a part of. Um, they... Uh, 
Does this mean they commented or just that there's just four comments? Oh, they did comment. I know the lyrics by heart, said Mina. Melody, would you ever do a cover? This is a jam. Um, can I click on these? Like the people? No. Okay. Oh. <laughs> I can leave a comment? Can I just type whatever I want? I, wow. Well, let's not do that. No reason to like anything from the dead either. By that I mean I don't want anybody to see on social media profiles that there's been some activity after their death has probably already been reported on in the media, I would assume, or will be soon. Yeah, I'm into BDSM. Building Discipline Strength Motivation. What? That's what it stands for, doesn't it? Oh, good one. That's a good one. Anything of any, any interest here? Nah. That's the group. I'm going to be cheesy real quick and say how much I love Aria, Mina, Rex... Wrapping up my week with Rebecca, nothing like some Ashtanga poses to properly close your week, especially if they take place at the beach. I'm seeing Ruben pop up quite a bit. Ruben Colis. Guys, don't be afraid to go to the gym. Nobody's judging you, trust me. Most of us are worried about our own progress and we're there to lift each other up. Let me settle this debate once and for all. Pineapple on pizza is good. Yeah, there's Reuben again. Man, I'm tempted to press like here to get it up to an even thousand, but let's not. I've had namaste thrown at me so many times that the word is starting to lose meaning. My intention was to inspire people. Sorry if I offended anyone with my posts. Now let's move forward and on to more positive things. What did they say? Something they deleted, I assume? Okay, some people here seem really angry. What do they do? I've never wanted to avoid being online until recently. I don't understand how people can come up with such vile things to say. All right, let's take a look at the feed. Who do they follow? Pumped up clicks. <laughs> so sorry, my phone and email have been acting up recently. Damn carriers. I'm afraid you can only reach me at my part-time job. Just like this post? Don't you wish you could get paid for just browsing? Uh-huh. Oh, hold on. Rex... Rex Keegan, businessman, consultant, philanthropist, educator. Grab success by the T-H-R-O-A-T. -T. What the hell does that stand for? Hmm. God, that looks 
looks so douchey. Everything about this just screams douche. Rex just said something. How you can earn $500 daily just by liking posts on Camara. For a mere price of $10,000, learn the scientifically proven throat method where you can turn your favorite pastime into a professional career. With the amount of money you'll be making, this is practically a steal. 10,000, over 10,000 members and counting. It's interesting that I can type in there as well. Who is Rex Keegan? They're a successful businessman, consultant, philanthropist, and educator. After establishing his online presence just over a year ago, Rex Keegan's following quickly grew to a now six-figure follower count on both Camara and Jabber combined. A network for achievers. Only the best of the best are welcomed into Rex's inner circle. Think you deserve to be one of the lucky few? Attend a talk to impress the man himself, and you might be invited into his orbit. Members only. Ah, so throat stands for timed, holistic, robust, outstanding appreciation technique. Wow, okay. Earnings and legal disclaimers. Uh -huh, not responsible for anything, blah, blah, blah. Right, let's go back. Let's not do the browser yet. Rex says, ugh, women, this is why the Get Rex Army are the only real ones. Aria, sell out? Please, some of us would rather work than cry and beg for what we have. Jealousy is a terrible disease. Get well soon. Mina, everything's crumbling. No one ever stays with me in my life. Rex, one drop of blood and the sharks are already swarming. Malika, I wish all my problems can be solved with an apology video. Late for work? Apology video. Forget your anniversary? Apology video. Straight up killed a dude? Apology video. Lauren, be true to you only with our limited edition eyewear. Protect yourself from those evil eyes and their negativity. Third eye chakra. A thousand four hundred dollars. Lana. Love it when people compliment my hair. Like, thank you. I grew it myself. Piping hot tea. Maya. Uh, Maya stopped posting a while ago. Anyone know what happened to her? There's Ruben. Internet detox? I heard it's quite popular. <laughs> Charmaine Wong. Me after eating one bag of Doritos. Maybe gamers have a point after all. <laughs> Doritos are pretty great. But gamers never have a point. Melody wrote a poem about this new barista. Um, I think it's just about how much they want to fuck him. Due to personal reasons, I've decided to stop aging. I'll only be turning 25 every year from now on. Thanks. Piping hot tea. So guess who saved the, uh, guess who saved the big influencer contacts leak before it got deleted? Me. Who knows? I might be in a sharing mood. Camarigate. Oh, Maya replied to that. I need someone's contact. I just DM'd you. Stalking someone? I'll trade you for some exclusive news. 
Anything you want, I'll talk. Maya practically offered to bribe hot tea for someone's contact. So they were desperate. 17 days ago, so this is when things were going bad. They were desperate to get the contact info from somebody else from Chimera. Uh, pros of living with me, you get a free concert every day because I love singing. Cons of living with me, I'm tone deaf. Jules was watering my plants on my balcony when a bird came by, so I said, What are you doing here, my scrumptious boy? Then my elderly neighbor replied, Letting the dog out for a piss. You? I want to die. Have an exciting sponsorship coming soon. Apparently some company found me alluring. Girlfriend told me to go big or go home, so I just went home. Maya. Oh, right. Any tweets um, from Maya are tweets we've already seen here. Oh, no, it took me to the top. Just did an online quiz to find out what kind of drink I am. Turns out that I'm stale room temperature water. I'm on a strict diet where I can only eat fruits, vegetables, and some other user. Anti-Rex League. <laughs> Whatever you do, do not trust this man. His name is Rex Keegan. He's a liar and an all-around fraud. He'll bleed you dry and toss you aside as soon as he gets what he wants. Help us get justice for his victims and get him off Jabber and Chimera by reporting his posts. This is a, uh, Maya says, this is a witch hunt. You have no proof. Also, harassment is another policy violation. Yeah, Maya was really close friends with Rex, like really defended them. Check my bank account and it says that I have 420 left. You know what that means. I can't afford rent this month. These are the flowers I gave Mina when I met her last night. It's the least I could do, considering how much her music has helped me heal through the worst years of my life. She was so kind and understanding. I cried. Thank you for everything, Mina. You're a light, and I love you forever. Mina's tragic stories may be made up or exaggerated, but they have genuinely helped others come to terms with their own grief and suffering. My girlfriend really thought that people from Germany were called Jaminis? <laughs> Hun, they're German. So this is my dentists, and y'all, some of the people here should keep their mouths closed to not ruin someone's day. That's fucked up. That's a really mean thing to say. Arya, I'm extremely late to Jabber as I mostly hang out on Chimera. I'm kind of desperate. I need a big follower boost for a big brand collab, so can we make a deal? Follow me on Jabber and like this post, and I promise I'll do something for you. Okay, so that's the thing we read about earlier about them. Uh, I think they sent an email or a, a message to Maya saying that I'm doing this. I'm asking for likes, but... I'm not asking your permission, just wanted you to know. Something like that. Arya is quick to take the easy way out of her problems, like asking for likes from her fans to boost her dwindling popularity. I'd like to think that unplugging my phone and turning to the other side of my bed is a workout of its own. My crush and his friend are doing tricks on the courtyard. Wish I could go over and split myself on his... dick, that probably says. 
I love rearranging the same five songs and calling it a playlist. Forgot to take the chicken out of the fridge before work and now I understand why my mom was so frustrated when I was a kid. My mom thought lol meant lots of love and she's been using it to reply to every post about my aunt's death. <laughs> Ruben, my hobbies have changed a lot since I was a kid. Before it was action figures, card collecting, and video games. Now it's avoiding traffic and paying my bills on time. Apparently, hashtag snack attack is against some law. And it's just a prank, bro, isn't a valid defense. Crazy, people don't know how to have fun these days. Have you tried the snack attack challenge? Casually take a stranger's food and eat it in front of them, then walk away. Food tastes better when it's someone else's. Just learned that I have NPC energy. What a relief. I'm too tired to be the main character in anything. That includes my own life. Oh, hold on. Am I missing comments for some stuff? This one, I didn't look. Just kind of glance over the comments, see if there's anything important. Mostly, usually there isn't. All right, that's all for Jabber. Can I just, like, go anywhere on Surfer, or...? No, there's history, and then I guess... I guess I can go anywhere. Can I go to Google? It's easy to be led astray when you are so broken. What the... F okay. Let's look at Chimera. A video from Rex. I really didn't want to have to do this, but when the haters try to drag you down like crabs in a bucket, I gotta speak up. Meet Ty Kowalski, a wannabe activist and my own personal stalker. This guy thinks I'm some kind of scam artist, as if I need to, con you know, fool people to make bank. All I know about this schmuck is, one, he took my course, two, he couldn't hack it, and three, he wants to blame everyone but himself. Ty is a loser cubicle monkey who's high on excuses and low on ambition. He knows he can't get better because he won't put in the work. You know, I'm not even that mad. This guy's life is so sad. I'm kind of sorry for him. Calling out my favorite hater at Ty Kowalski. This dude has been a thorn in my side long enough. My hashtag get Rex Ninja apprentices, you know what to do. To the rest of you, try me. I dare you. Hashtag talk shit get hit. And then lots of yelling at each other and blah blah blah. Oh, I can click on the profiles. Okay. That's weirdly musical. <laughs> so there's their stalker. Ah, counts private. Rex's account. 92,000 followers. I lost a friend recently. Knowing her, she wouldn't want me moping around. Cheers, Maya. Dedicating my next million earned to you. <laughs> Jesus. Um. How far do I follow the rabbit hole? Because I'm... 
looked at a user and then looked at somebody who commented on a post, which then took me to Rex's place again, and then I, I could just follow that rabbit hole down really, really far. I guess keep looking at this one. Private. A lot of private. They're all private. Every single one. I guess it's probably going to be mostly the same people commenting. Well, maybe not. There's some new ones. Oh god, I'm getting so confused. Uh, where am I? Okay. Here's an opportunity you don't want to miss, my friends. You see, the way to hustle smart is you got to fly close to the sun. You gotta find your role model and orbit that sun like a mofo. That's how you're gonna grow. Here's your chance to get into my orbit, up close and personal. I'm looking for two ninja apprentices. People will pay hundreds of thousands to get into this vortex, but I'm not in this for the money. I'm lowballing this opportunity for you. It's cheaper than going to college. Let's do this. All because people don't understand what I do. But enough's enough. It's time I prove all the haters wrong. See, I've been called many things since my start on Chimera. A liar, cheater, scammer, without actual proof. Well, now I'm going to clear up all the lies you've been told. For the first time ever, I am selling my online seminars to the public. I'm extending an invitation to all my haters. Participate in my seminars and you'll see that I'm not such a bad guy. Just misunderstood. Aha! Uh -huh. Somebody who's not private. Rex's new recruit is a user named Pumped Up Clicks, which Maya also follows. They're offering to be a referral to Rex's talk, and they shared an email address. Currently part of the Get Rex movement to help you expand your brand and earn big bucks on Camara. Have big plans to make Camara your career? Eager to grow your audience and triple your income? Looking for referrals to get into the next hashtag get Rex talk. Punch your doubts in the face and email info at pumpedupclicks.web now. Got a big event coming up soon. Any one of you ladies would be lucky to be my date. Like this post, and I'll consider taking you. Warning. You have to at least look like Margot Robbie, and she's a week six. This person. What is this, a boot camp for incels? <laughs> if you've been whining about that hustler life, I've got two words for you. Man the hell up! If you want to make that pivot to success, you gotta bring your A-game every single day! Get out of your comfort zone! 
Think big to win big. You gotta think big, visualize it, and then do it. You gotta ignore the haters and just do you. You gotta move fast, break things, and take those broken shards and carve out your success. Stick with my program, and you can be the one driving a sweet ride like this. Sacrifice is not an option. It's the whole game. Life is hard, and you gotta be harder. All my life, people said I'd never amount to anything. Over and over again, I was treated like dirt despite my best efforts. Hell, there's even a whole group dedicated to my downfall. Well, I'm getting the last laugh. The coveted BizCon invited me to speak. I'm writing to you now at the end of a successful session, full house, and a standing ovation from the audience. This goes to show, don't let the haters get you down. Despite his dubious side business, Rex is still recognized by legitimate organizations like BizCon and gets invited to speak there. There's Arya. Not private, of course. Um, hold on a second. Before we go looking at their stuff, let's finish out Rex, because there's one more thing. What's up, ballers? Let's make some noise! Come on, yeah! All right, all right, listen up. I get it. I get you. I've done that nine to five, and it sucked balls! It sucks! Yeah. For you and me, we're dreamers. We're going to grab success by the throat, and we're going to own it! Yeah! Yeah! yeah. I'm going to show you how! Let's do it! Let's do it! Come on! Yeah. Woo! Did this with two hours of sleep, multiple deadlines in my head, and a sick stomach. But when you got hundreds of people depending on you, you gotta man up and do shit. Oh, and there's, oh, there's Maya's account. Actually, does that, we can't even click on it. Okay, that makes sense. All right, so that's all of it for them. So let's go look at Aria.